Today we'll be showing you how to remove the stock reed cage and install Melosi carbon fiber reeds versus the stock steel reeds. If you follow me up here, we're going to go ahead and we're just going to pull off. This is where the carburetor would bolt on normally. We're going to go ahead and remove that. And then we're going to go ahead and pull off the reed cage here. Normally this would be bolted in, obviously. We've already disassembled this partly for the video. See, this is what a stock one looks like already as it's bolted in here. We're going to flip around and this is a this is the stock part. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to unscrew the reed cage here. This is a pretty simple job. There's the second one. Now we're just going to lift off on here. Fall right in. So here's your stock stainless steel reed. There. Not too bad. We're going to upgrade to a Melosi carbon fiber stiffer reed cage right here. So we just want to set this in place, noting that the inner circles are on the downside here, and the upper circles have extra room. You always want to make sure your room's the same here. We're going to go ahead and we're going to center it. And drop it on. Okay. okay, both of our reeds here are now installed as you can see, and we're all tight here, good to go. You can go ahead and give it a little test here just by sticking your pinky in and barely touching it, making sure it snaps back nice and quickly. You know you've done your job correctly. Now we're going to go ahead and we're going to drop this reed cage right back into the basket, just like so. Now you're ready to bolt your intake manifold back on and you're done.